see my grip, right? My hands, okay? So, again, Luke Falcon's out of the way. Middle knuckle of index to middle knuckle of uh, firing hand, about that 45 degree angle, okay? I'm gonna come up, over, and over, up, over, and over, up, over, and over. What did my gun do? Nothing, straight back. Sometimes it just looks like it shakes in place, right? Because I'm on trapping the boraxes above, below, and behind. Now, you guys are probably going, yeah, bro, we know you shoot for Walther. You got that five inch PDP jam mm -hmm. done by Boresight and Monsoon. Of course you can do with that awesome gun. You can't do it with my shitty gun. Somebody come up here and give me their shitty gun. Yeah, cool. Awesome. awesome. Shadow systems. Oh, no, you're good, dude. Just keep loading. Oh, this is a Zev? It is. Oh, Z9? It is. Okay. Not a shitty gun until that breaks. Anyway, uh, so we got a, uh, so this is, this is a regular 17 size gun, right? Uh, Zev, good gun, good gun, not bad, right? Let's see what happens though, but smaller than mine. Let's see what happens, let's go out here. Up, over, up, over, up, over. What happened? Nothing. Nothing. Anybody got a SIG? Oh, good for you guys. Oh, uh, come on over here, man. <laughs> yeah, don't pull out your guns, you get here. Go. Poor guy. <laughs> Okay, cool. So what do thank you, sir? What does everybody complain about with SIGs? And the fact they explode when you drive more high, high, high bore axis, this thing right here. But here's the thing: if you think your recoil is inhibited by this, which stops your firing hand from getting up higher, then you don't understand that recoil control comes from your support hand, right? So let's talk about this high bore axis gun and what it can actually do. Oh, that's not that right? Up over. Up. Gun do? Nothing. Do you know has the same bore axis as a SIG 320? A 1911. Anybody ever here has a 1911 has a high bore axis? No. The internet needs to be quiet sometimes. There you go. Cool. Anybody shooting any duty ammo? No? Okay. 40 or 45? Nope. Same thing. It hurts more, right? Because you got more of a pop going on there. As long as you trap the bore axis above, below, and behind, you are good to go. Small guns too. 365s. Uh, the SIG 938, the 19 small 1911 looking gun, right? Uh, the worst gun ever made, the Springfield Hellcat, right? Same thing, same thing, right? Because I'm trapping it. If you guys watch my Instagram, you'll see me shooting these tiny little guns. It literally looks like bullets are coming out of my hand because you can't see the gun move, right?